Hey man, stay safe world. You already know what's going on. We gotta talk about this situation right now with Jace. Basically, I've been seeing hella places online. Actually, it kind of started from like the Cash Dami Jace beef of basically people saying that like Jace's mom is a cop and that kind of discredits him from like the street lifestyle or whatever. So I decided that we should get into this topic and try to figure out and discover if there's any evidence of this being true, debunk this myth and decide whether or not we could even discredit this because it's like something that I've seen hella times. But before we get into that, man, I'm gonna need y'all to like, comment, subscribe, and let's run this up. So I first started seeing like rumors of this on mad like Reddit pages all up on youtube like specifically too when they um basically if you didn't know already cash Tommy and jace have been having like an ongoing beef for like over a year now where like jace basically called cash Tommy out for claiming like ebk and claiming like that or claiming that ebk and then claiming he was also blood too and then basically saying that he was false claiming or whatever which means basically saying that he was in a uh like claiming that he was in a gang when he really wasn't so in doing that he was basically saying that he was like pretending to be a gang and then at the same time as that there's been hella people pointing out that he i mean trying to expose him and his gang ties and stuff jace's so it's kind of like been a back and forth but one of the most popular comments that i've been seeing in this is basically that his mom is a police officer and I've been trying to figure out if that's true or not. If y'all got any evidence, more evidence on this topic, definitely drop it in the comments, man. I've been trying to look. I've been searching for like three days for this topic. It's kind of reason why I haven't been posting this shit. But in doing so, I've searched damn near everywhere. I feel like one of the main claims basically was she was a cop, but then a lot of people are saying that she's a corrections officer, which is different than a police officer. But let me know in the comments if y'all think that's even the same thing or different. I mean, Rick Ross was a whole corrections officer and then now he's like a fucking million dollar rapper or whatever with an estate and has cows and shit. Basically made a whole career off of stealing someone else's likeness or whatever and was a whole cop. But I mean, if you didn't know already, corrections officers are like literally one of the most like corrupt things i don't even know what they're considered police officers are they but all i know is they're like super corrupt like everywhere they're pretty much corrupt they're the res people responsible for like actually getting drugs into prisons and stuff there was actually an article that new york times dropped on um where they basically said that like they banned visits over the pandemic like people coming in and visiting inmates and stuff because of the pandemic and when they banned visits the amount of drugs and contraband found in the jail were actually doubled or increased uh, and i feel like that kind of just shows that it's uh, a lot different between a corrections officer and a police officer because a lot of people are saying that she's a corrections officer i've been trying to figure out the evidence i'm gonna get into that later but it just shows that like they're different i feel like they have a different mindset than cops i feel like corrections officers are literally just people that are just trying to get money like cops are people that seem like they're trying to get power and the only real power that you really have as a corrections officer is in prison really i mean maybe on the streets or whatever but you know corrections officers are super dirty so i wouldn't put it besides if his mom was a corrections officer he'd still be able to have his gang ties or whatever that he currently has allegedly he's like a five deuce hoover or something like i mean when you look at the situation like just the fact that corrections officers are super super corrupt everywhere it makes you wonder do they even count as police but that's even if we are able to find evidence of his mom even being a corrections officer if y'all got any evidence link me because i've been like i said searching far and wide i've went from all the way back from jason's fucking facebook from like years ago i went through that shit to try to find like his friends try to see if i could find his mom's profile or whatever see if she had any pictures couldn't find that shit i looked up the corrections officer database in texas fort worth texas or whatever try to see if i could find that shit i couldn't find anything there so i'm not even 100 percent if that rumor is even true because you know in this rap beef type shit a lot of speculations go out everywhere and the people say stuff but they never really have 
have any evidence and i've yet to find evidence but it's like such a popular thing that people be saying but another point i want to point out is like i personally know people who are like the the children of police officers i know one person specifically i'm not going to name them but they're like the literal son of a police officer in new york and they're the biggest fucking trap lord that i know it's crazy like how does that happen hmm well i think of it as police officers probably don't get paid a lot like there's lots of stories of this being like this like my homie in particular he was like oh he's a whole crib he sells lean he sells pills he sells all types of drugs he'd be supplying and shit he'd be doing all types of shit he was doing it he's not in new york anymore but he was doing it even there so that makes you wonder how are you even able like if he could do that and i know this for certain that he does this shit then it's like anyone could really fucking like do that type of shit and i feel like it's part of the reason is maybe like police aren't really like getting paid as much or like police officers in general are kind of crooked i mean like not every police officer is a saint and they're not gonna probably arrest their own kid unless they're really about it i mean jace though in his situation i know he has songs where he literally mentions that his mom tried to call the cops on him or whatever and like like his mom is worried about his life I know in an interview he talked about how his dad left this whole situation so he was literally raised with his mom for a couple years or whatever so obviously i mean he was it sounds like he was doing other stuff because like he also mentions in interviews how he almost overdosed also or he did overdose and then he was revived he also mentions how he got like caught up for a gun case and stuff so obviously his mom wasn't like really policing what he was doing and i don't really think it's like some fake shit but i mean it's the question i feel like we should be asking is if your parent is a police officer does that ultimately make you not a gangster rapper i mean let me know in the comments but it's it's a lot of questions about this and does a corrections officer even count as a police officer here let me look it up right now is a corrections officer a police officer it says while police officers patrol the streets and investigate crimes corrections officers um like basically just patrol prisons jails and courtrooms they enforce rules and keep order but yes corrections officers are law enforcement officers why correctional professionals shouldn't be overlooked well basically i guess they are corrections officers so i mean like if his mom were a corrections officer yes indeed that would mean she's a cop does that mean that she's like as like not um as loyal to the law as a normal cop i mean i feel like chances are the percentages if you were to have a percent of like i feel like the police officers that are out on the street are a lot more loyal to the law than the average corrections officer because there's so much contraband and shit that be going in i feel like corrections officers probably get paid less too so they're more willing to deal with illegal shit and do illegal shit just because they're in jail and can make money from it so that too but i mean i guess just because you're someone's like son or daughter doesn't mean that you're not like in the streets because I mean, allegedly you look at like Freddie Gibbs or whatever. I mean, yeah, academics be talking shit, but at, Freddie Gibbs admits that he was the son of a police officer. Says his dad was super crooked as a police officer and got removed, but at least he admits it or whatever. I mean, I guess there's public records going back on it. And I guess that's just another example of what could happen, but I feel like it definitely puts into question of the type of shit that he says. I guess you could claim that like, because he's related to a police officer, that could be some type of issue like a conflict of interest basically and maybe he's not really a like hood rapper but i don't know man just like looking through all the evidence and shit i haven't even found anything that even showed that it was and i've been digging deep i'm gonna keep looking probably make a part two to this video if i get more information man but let me know in the comments what y'all think you think that like just because he's a son of a corrections officer if he even is a hundred percent like does that disqualify him from being able to rap about like shooting people and like doing drugs and like fucking like hitting legs and shit or do you think that it doesn't matter
That's the ultimate question here. Let me know in the comments. Real estate say shit. You already know what's going on. Like, comment, subscribe. Yes, sir. Let's go.